Hello everyone and welcome back to another tutorial video. So in today's video, we are going to be talking about spoiler tags within Discord. So as you can see, we are in Discord now. I am logged in. Uh, and down below here, you can see that I've typed some stuff here into this specific channel on Discord. Uh, as you can see here, there is something that's hidden. It's got a black kind of mask on top of it there to where you cannot read it. Uh, no matter if I hover over it, no matter if I kind of, you know, move my mouse, it's still not going to show. This is called a spoiler tag on Discord. So basically, in order to read this, uh, you would have to click on it and then boom, it's highlighted and it says this is how you mark as a spoiler on Discord. Now, you can do this for both text and images. Uh, you may want to do this if you're not wanting to spoil a video game, a movie, a book, or anything like that uh, that you're trying to hide and let people and users know that, hey, if you click on this, you may be spoiled for this specific uh, thing that we're talking about. So in order to do this for text, what you're going to want to do is go ahead and start typing a message and go ahead and do the backslash. So you can see here backslash and then all of the commands come up here. And the one that you're going to want to do obviously is one that is called spoiler. So go ahead and do slash spoiler and then go ahead and type your spoiler text next. All right, once you've typed your spoiler text here, so you do slash spoiler and then type all the text that you want to hide, go ahead and click enter as you would any normal message. And as you can see now, that text is hidden. So if we go here and hover over it, we can't see it, but if we click on it, boom, there the spoiler is, and you are good to go. All right, and in order to do a spoiler tag for images, go ahead and click the addition symbol here like you're going to go ahead and add an image to this message chain, and then go ahead and select the image or double click on the image, and go ahead and upload this image like you normally would. But right here, you're gonna see something that says mark as spoiler. Make sure that is checked, and then go ahead and click the blue upload button there. As you can see, it's going to have the spoiler tag on top of the image, and it's going to be blurred out. So in order for someone to see it, yep, you guessed it, you just click on it and then boom, they can see the image that you're trying to not spoil there. So that's how you do images and text. And in order to do this on a mobile device on the Discord app, it's literally exactly the same. It's just a smaller screen, right? So you do backslash or slash spoiler and then you type the text. And then when you're uploading an image from mobile, uh, you'll have that same tab that you can just check right there that says spoiler, and it works exactly the same way as it does on desktop. Now, if you have any questions about how to do any of this or anything with Discord, put that in the comments section below. If you would, help me out by liking, sharing, and subscribing to the channel for more great tech tips just like this, and I will see you guys in the next video.